Good day everyone, it's Christian Living Education Time, and for today's lesson, we will be focusing on the topic, We Belong to the Family of God. Of course, before we proceed to our topic discussion, let me just show you our learning targets for this lesson. First is, I want you to learn to explain their membership in the family of God. Second is, I want us all to learn to desire to live as member of the family of God. And lastly, I want us all to learn to celebrate the membership in the family of God. So these are the three things that I want us all to learn after this asynchronous class. Before we proceed to my discussion, I just want you to ask these questions. And you just need to answer it on your own. First question, who are the members of your family? Second question, are you happy to belong to your family? Third question, do you love your family? Fourth question, how do you show love to your family? Plus, when you were baptized, you become a disciple of Christ. Baptism sa Tagalog po ay bininyagan. So, when the day you were baptized, the day you were baptized, you become a disciple of Christ. We all belong to this group, the family of God. So, we are all brothers and sisters because we are the family of God. We belong to the family of God. From this new life in Christ and being united in His body, the Church, baptism is the effective symbol of our sharing in the divine life. We become a new creation, sharers in the divine nature, not simply creatures anymore but children of God through the Son of Jesus Christ in the Holy Spirit who dwells in us. In baptism, sa binyag, we share in God's divine life, our new life in Christ. With Christ, we are united in His body, the Church. We become members of God's family, the Church. So this is the meaning, why do we belong to the family of God? So I want us all to bear this four points in our mind. Because on our next synchronous classes, Teacher Kathy will going to have a short review about this. And of course, I am going to ask questions about this. Now, it's time for activity. I want you to bring out your pencil and your notebook. For your activity, I want you also to bring out your CL book. And kindly turn it to page 74 and answer enhancing our faith and page 75 living our faith so i want you to answer in your notebook because you are not allowed to write anything on your book for those who do not have a book don't worry check out the uploaded file in the sms I provided a copy of the page of your book for you to answer the activity also. After this video class, please continue with your activity, okay? Don't worry, we will answer your activity once we get back to our synchronous class. And with that, I hope you will continue to answer the activity. That ends our lesson for today. See you and goodbye everyone.